major 9-11 takeaways. Conspiracy theory, idiocy explained. Come on, girl. Let's go outside. Okay, I'm doing a quick response video to Warren Pollock. He just did a video. Anyway, so he's saying that 9-11 uh, wasn't a conspiracy. Basically, it was just one of those things where we looked the other way and stuff happened, whatever. It's just, I can't, I can't buy that. And if, there's no way planes take down a building. It's obvious to me. that it was a conspiracy and it's not weird that there are conspiracies <laughs> people aren't idiots because because there are conspiracies it's the con conspiracies themselves that are idiots but they are there so I'm not gonna hide my head in the sand I don't know if you know who Warren E. Pollock is he's been doing some videos on you know the financial collapse and stuff like that so I'm not a troll and I don't I don't dislike people's videos but I can't personally I can't listen to somebody who doesn't know the simplest things the most obvious things if, if you can't understand that there's a conspiracy within our government to take down those towers. I mean, if you can't understand that, I don't want to explain it, but I mean, if you can't understand it, then you're not looking hard enough, and the fact that you're not looking, to me, means you don't care. And you don't have to care, that's all right. But I need to know before I follow you and what you say and believe in what you're talking about. I need to know where you stand on these things. Because you could be full of shit. That's the deal. And I'm wasting my time. I could be wasting my time listening to somebody who's probably preaching establish establishment bullshit. So it's good that I know that. I want you to check out his video and I'll try and leave a link. If I can, I don't know if he's blocked me. All I said to him was, you know, in the comment section was that he needs to look into it more, otherwise he's wasting our time. To me, that's what he's doing. He's wasting people's time if he doesn't know the basics. And it's okay if... I don't mind if people don't think it was a conspiracy. That's all right. You know, I don't dislike people. They just... They have a different level of experience. They know different things. Look into it. That's all, I'm, that's all I ask. So when I first looked into 9-11, I thought, too, that it was, as he does, I thought, okay, there was a lot of mistakes made, you know. But then when I looked into it more, and you just review the video, I mean, you can see the little explosions and everything. <laughs> I mean, it's just so obvious. All, you, all I needed to do, personally, other people, maybe it takes more, I don't know. All I needed to do was see the video. That's all you need. To, all I need to do, because I, I understand physical forces and all that stuff. So, for me, it would be a leap of faith <laughs> to believe that there was no conspiracy. <laughs> I would have to delude myself, and I don't want to do that. So I'd like people to check out Warren's video and voice your opinion uh, either way whichever way you see it support him or uh, thumbs down or thumbs up or whatever whatever but I think people should be heard on this one to me it how outrageous is it to believe that there are conspiracies. 
thing. <laughs> Come on. They control everything, and to think that they can't, they, whoever they are, they can't pull off, with their full control of the media, they can't pull off this stunt and lie about it. The full control of the media and the government, they can't pull this off. Even the Russians say that it would have to, it would require an intelligence service of an, an entire country to pull off. <laughs> so... If we can't see this basic thing, I don't see how we're going to get out from under this, I say, tyrannical government. If they, if they can do such a thing to start a war or whatever their reason was, they, went, they ended up running off doing all kinds of wars, right, based on this terror, supposed terror threat. If they can do that and kill millions of people... This is something you need to know about. You need to know that that they're doing this and that they cannot be trusted. You can't trust somebody who does that. Come on. You can't sit around and think, oh, well, my vote is going to change. <laughs> change this or that when they run the whole thing. Now you're just screwed. You got to know where you stand and you stand nowhere. You, you're just screwed. You have no political voice. YouTube is about the best you can do. <laughs> so 9-11 is like a big wake-up call. If you don't get it, okay. You don't get it and then we're all screwed. It's just more of the same. I don't know. We've probably been screwed all along. <laughs> how long have we been screwed? Since Roman times? I don't know how long. <laughs> so it'll be more of the same? Alright. Well, I don't like this. I don't like the way things are. So I think maybe Warren is just a lot of hot air. I've been trying to encourage him, you know. He thinks this system is real, but it's all fake. He talks to Max Kaiser, and, you know, he knows all these people. I mean, Max knows what's going on, except for the carbon thing. <laughs> I don't think it's idiocy. I don't think it's idiocy, idiocy to believe in a 9-11 conspiracy. It's not. Don't fall for that. Just look into it. You don't have to believe it, just look into it. Just watch the videos, there's millions of them. Watch those towers fall. Oh, pulverized concrete, yeah, naturally. Nope. So yeah, I don't want to go into why it's bullshit. You can determine that for yourselves. Nobody has to believe it. So if we don't, if we don't literally do something, we're screwed. And Tenor Bruce T is saying, he says, well, don't vote, because the voting system's all rigged, and all the candidates are all baloney. Like, yeah, I know that. <laughs> but voting is the minimum that you should be doing. we got to do something. We have to actually do something. Or we're just going to have more of the same. And unfortunately, people don't know what the same is that we're going to get more of. It's tyranny. That's what it is. Oh, yes, you don't like the tyranny. <laughs> Me neither. So let's do something. Check out that video and... Voice your opinion nicely. Nobody likes trolls. Okay, have a good day.